Hey there, Poke Battle fan here. I just fought this person who called him or herself Pinkie Pie. That's hilarious. And well, let's just watch. It was a triple battle, by the way. So she starts starts with Goldberg person and Mr. Mime and yeah she's a shiny hunter. So I was surprised to see that Rose Ray wasn't the fastest in this in this round. So I boost both uh, I boost my Scullipede here. Also, I try to use knockoff on that Mr. Mime, which works and kills it. So, Golda uses Psychic on Rosray but doesn't quite kill it. Speed boost activate. And Pinkie Pie sends out Koros, which is also a shiny. Yeah, they're all all our team is shiny by the way. So I switch for Togekiss because I'm about to use Earthquake with Solipede here. I was surprised that Toros had that much defense. So Persian die here. Golduck survives. And I don't know why did Thoros use strength. And with Skullfeed also survived the cycle. I didn't expect that to be honest. Oh and by the way I I gave my letter to Togekiss and got a black slot for my Skullfeed. Which is kind of down fan. Then I use Protect on Scullipede, then Aqua Jet with Problem. Which doesn't even deal half HP da of damage. So Pogekiss dies here. Speed boost. I go with High Dragon so I can use Earthquake again. I use Aqua Jet on Toros because I kind of expect the Earthquake to kill Dantan here because it's my double attack, but it survived. Oh, sorry about that. So Crowdon dies here, and if I remember right, so does High Dragon, or maybe he dies at the next turn. Oh, Toros dies here. Oh yeah, Dantan dies here. Actually, it kills itself by killing Skullipede. Sorry, I have to move it a bit. So I sent out my last two remaining Pokémon, Rose Red and Rampardo. And she sends out Miltank, which is her last Pokémon. By that point, I expected her to for feet, but she didn't. And she avoid Rock Slide here. So Miltank takes a lot of damage, and Rose Red finishes off, finishes off with the black uh, slot bomb and that's it i won hope you enjoyed see you next time